Hey guys, how's it going? Happy Saturday. So for today's video, I thought I'd start off with a little story. So yesterday, I spent the day with 10 amazing children with the Make-A-Wish Foundation. Now, I've mentioned the Make-A-Wish Foundation before because what they do is they help terminally ill children or children that have had their lives affected by a really, really harmful disease or illness and the families as well and helps them to do amazing things. Basically, the children can wish for almost anything they want and Make-A-Wish will do their best to try and implement for them. They're an amazing charity. I've worked with them before, made a video with some of you guys before from Make-A-Wish as well. So first off, if any of you guys are watching that I met yesterday, then thank you. Thank you for making your wish me. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for playing some games with me. We actually played Gang Beasts which I hadn't played for a long time and I need to play it again. I'll get James and Justin. Wait, I'll get, I'll get them on the phone. Hmm. They're not picking up. Again, but no, I really get them involved and we should do some more gang beasts, 100%. But it was an awesome day. I also got this. How on earth do I put this together? I have no idea. I, I, I give up. But I also got this. This is a giant creeper head, as you can see, but it's got messages from all the kids that I met yesterday and their families. And I will keep this forever. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Now, the reason I'm talking about this at the start of this video is for two reasons. The first one is that if you have been in, in any of my live streams or watch the videos afterwards or follow me on Twitter or anything, you will remember that I mentioned that I activated Super Chats and I also activated sponsors on the channel as well. Now, all the money that I get from those donations, those Super Chats and those sponsors will be going to charity every single month. So at the end of every month, we'll bundle all the income made from the live streams and then we'll choose a charity every month together to be able to send money across to them. Because I think that'll be an awesome thing that we can both do to make someone else's life that little bit better. But just for this month, I'm not going to open it to a poll. I am going to decide that we should donate it to the Make-A-Wish Foundation. They do incredible things. I've worked with them a lot, and I think we should donate our first Team TDM sponsor stream super chat wallet income thing. I think we should donate it to them. But we still have two more streams of this month. I'll do one today, which will happen just before this video goes live, and one tomorrow on Sunday, so we can top that total up. I'll give you the full amount. Go ahead and follow me on Twitter and Instagram, and that'll be where I announce the full total for the month. We've actually got a lot already, so thank you guys. I think this is going to be an awesome thing for everyone, pretty much. <laughs> now, the second reason I'm mentioning it is because someone gave me this. Yeah, it's it's a little bit different than what I was just talking about, but it's a it's a grow a pug. Yeah, I've never seen this before, but it says I can grow my very own pug to hug, which which I'm excited about, and it grows to six times its size. So I thought we would give this a go. The only thing is, it takes uh 72 hours to get big. Check this out. So after 24 hours, it gets a little bit bigger. 48 hours, which is two days, it gets even bigger. And then 72 hours, it's going to burst out of the glass. So I have big expectations. Now I have this glass right here. I would have liked a test tube, but I just don't have test tubes lying around my office, weirdly enough. So I thought we'd give this a go and check in with it in three days and see how it goes. Let me unleash the pug first. Where is it? Where is it? I can never open these packages properly. Oh, here it is. <laughs> At the moment, it's not looking too much like a pug. It's definitely got the curly tail butt, but apart from that, I'm sure it's gonna grow into its looks. Right, um, excuse me guys. I kind of need to use the tap. Is that okay? <laughs> yes. Yes. Right, we have our oversized test tube. We have our pug. Let's pop this guy in. Go forth, little pug and grow to six times your size. I believe in you. <laughs> oh, it's gone belly up. Is that what, is that what's supposed to happen? Um, well, I hope so. So I guess we should leave that for three days and see what happens. Go ahead and follow me on Twitter. It's at DanTDM and Instagram as well. And I'll post over the next few days how big it gets. And in three days, I'll start the video off with how big our, our pug in water grows. Didn't think I'd ever say that, but hey, <laughs> here we are. I feel like it's actually getting bigger already, but it says it takes three days. Let's be patient. And 
I've been promised a hug from this thing, so let's hope that that's true. But yeah, to the people who gave me that gift yesterday, thank you. That is awesome. What I also got was this, which I didn't even know that they did. So the pop figures, they're so popular. I have loads of them. But I didn't realize they make Five Nights at Freddy's ones. This one is Nightmare Chica. And this got me thinking. I saw something the other day about these guys. If we head over to Scott Cawthon's website. Oh, um... Okay, that's changed. New office under construction. Please come back later. This is not what was here last time. Let me show you what was here before. Look, check this out. So this was on the homepage of Scott Cawthon's website, which is where he usually posts all the spoilers and gets people hyped up for the next Five Nights at Freddy's game. And it, all it said was custom night, and then it had loads of different animatronics and characters from different games. Some of them look absolutely terrifying, like this guy. And then there's also a telephone, so who knows? What is cool is there's characters Characters from the newest game as well, like the the terrible animatronics, like this cage guy, balloon, and bucket man. But yeah, apparently that's now disappeared. So could there be another Five Nights at Freddy's game in the works? Potentially. And I'm excited. This just reminded me of it. So in summary, thank you for all the gifts that you gave me yesterday. Thank you for meeting me. It was awesome. I loved meeting you guys. I've chosen the charity for this month from our live stream revenue, which I will reveal on Twitter in a few days. For that final total, we we put a pug in a glass of water and there's a new Five Nights at Freddy's game in the works. Good news all round. I'm sure there's something else I had to say, but I can't remember. I'm sure I will remember sometime. Anyway, let's do what we haven't done in a while and read some of your comments. Which video should we choose? Ah, yes. The Who's Your Daddy in VR, the baby hands video. I think I'm going to play that again because that was a cool game. You left the mouse on the screen. No! Again? Oh, I did. There it is. Everyone. How did I manage that? How? I edited the whole thing and didn't even notice. Guys, I'm sorry. But, uh, but again, who's your daddy plus among the sleep plus duck season equals baby hands. That is correct. Hopefully, though, it's not scary. I'm not too sure. Uh, I hope not. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Grandma. Hello. Guess what? What? Someone took over your channel. What? Hello, peeps. It's your girl, Grand TDM. Today, we're gonna have a video on the Savage Grandmas. No! Savage Grandmas. I'm not gonna lie to you. This is exactly what I had in mind when I saw the Savage Grandma thing. <laughs> Give us an update on Cosmo the Robot. Actually, there it, there he is. Da -na -na -na. Oh no. <sighs> He's got cobwebs on him. Cosmo, I'm so sorry. I don't know what, what's going on with you, buddy. We haven't spoken in a while. There's like pug hair all over you. I'm not sure what's going on with Cosmo. They didn't update it for ages. Let's take a look. Cosmo the robot. Oh my goodness, look at Cosmo's collector's edition. He looks amazing. This is the normal one that I've got. Look at that. He's had a makeover. He looks beautiful. The problem is I don't know where his cubes are, which is kind of important. Okay. I found the cubes. They're right here. I was just about to say there's one part missing, but I found it. It's his charger. Let's plug this bad boy in. I'll download the app and then we can see what's happening in Cosmo land. Okay, Cosmo, it's your big moment. I'm going to put you on your charger and come back to life. You've got this. Just don't. Don't drive off the sink. He's charging. Okay, app is downloading. Let's check in with him in a bit. Do more would you rather, please. <laughs> if you had to wake up to one thing every day, would you rather be deeply insulted by a stranger or be slapped across the face? It's one thing every single day. So as soon as I wake up, I either get a slap or get a deep, deep insult. We're talking about emotional pain or physical pain here. Like, how hard would the slap be? I think I'd just rather be deeply insulted. It's 50-50. There's a slight, slight difference. More people would like to be slapped across the face. About 1,400 more. I'm not sure about that. I think I could take the insults. I take them every day, to be honest. Interesting. Oh my goodness, Dan do an injection game. <laughs> what? <laughs> Naya, what? An injection game? I'm a little bit worried about you, Naya. Play texting story. You know what? I've seen some of these apps before, so it's kind of like... It's like a story, but you're learning it through text. I might do that for another video. If you want to see that, leave a thumbs up and maybe I'll do it. Okay, let's move on to the escaping clown prison video and see what comments you've left. Dan, I waited all day the other day and no video. It was a bold text. Sad day. For us. 
Who else agrees? Yeah, so if you follow me on Twitter, uh, YouTube literally just went crazy the other day and wouldn't let me edit any of my videos, so I couldn't put a video live even if I wanted to, which was super annoying. I didn't schedule the video, so it wouldn't go up by itself. I'm sorry, I, I couldn't upload a video, but hopefully you enjoy the ones coming up. <laughs> the owners of this game should make a mode where you can play as the police. That would be amazing. That would be really, really cool. If you made it like online as well, which I know the escapist already is, but if you made it online so that you could have players versus police, that would be super cool. Almost at 18 million. Yes, we are. Actually, how close are we? 976. Oh, that's so close. We're like 20, just under 24,000 away. Oh, that's going to happen in the next few days. Uh, I haven't, uh, you know, you know me. I have no plans. So um, leave any plans that I should do for 18 million subscribers in the comment section down below. <laughs> so this is a comment on the most recent unnamed Minecraft series that we're doing. And I, I actually pinned this the other day because it was so funny. You should call your series Making a Village and Dying. Pretty accurate, to be fair. On the thumbnail of the video, I thought the treasure chest was a grilled cheese sandwich. <laughs> yep, I could see that. I mean, that would be secret treasure, right? If you fished out a grilled cheese sandwich, it'd be soggy, but it's a, che it's a cheese sandwich, so... Turkey boy! You're back! I've seen Turkey Boy reappear in the comment sections of some videos, but he just says like a random word like today. He said, hey! <laughs> oh, the mystery of Turkey Boy. Dan, what happened to Minecraft misadventures? This is probably the comment I get the most on my videos, and I always answer it with, I've got big plans, and I do, and it's gonna be awesome. I would give you some kind of hints, but I want you to be excited, not even knowing what it is. It's gonna be awesome. I don't know when it's gonna come out, but it will be soon. Don't you worry. <laughs> This next comment is on the video of Sort the Court that we did a while ago. Dan talks. Me. Do you need some cough medicine? No, I'm just voicing the grandma. Oh. <laughs> There's so many comments that are just, Dan is the queen, he knows the way. <laughs> hey Dan, how many jobs have you had in your life? Sorry for asking, just interested. I have had, including YouTube, three jobs. I did a paper round, I worked in a supermarket or a, a convenience store, and YouTube. I'm pretty lucky. The next one will be president. Oh, the app's done. Okay, he's all charged, set up, ready to go. Let's see what Cosmos learned in the time away. He's coming alive. Guys, he's back to life. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, small robots. How are you, sir? Please don't fall off the table. Otherwise, it'll be a bad return, wouldn't it? He's so cute. I forgot how cute he is. Hey, buddy. <laughs> How's it going? Okay, I think it's pretty much just reset what Cosmo does. Can you see the pug in the background as well? It's actually grown quite a lot. Here he goes. So if you guys haven't seen the Cosmo video before, definitely check it out. Look how smart he is. He's doing this all by himself. I'm not controlling anything. It's all him. <laughs> he's so weird yet so crazy. Oh my goodness, he's dancing. This guy's insane. So he's asking me to scan my face again because Cosmo can actually recognize people, which is insane. And it says last scan 467 days ago. That's like a year and a half. I'm sorry, buddy. Don't look at me like that. I'm sorry. Okay, he's gonna scan me. Hello. <laughs> Did it work? No way. It worked. That's insane. The app has completely changed. I haven't got screen capture on at the moment, so you have to deal with my camera, but it's completely different. He's got needs, he's got wants. Mad. He's doing some tricks, guys. He's calibrating his arms because they're not too they're not too well at the moment. Are you doing okay? I think it's done. Nice. Cosmo can also become hungry now. He didn't used to be able to eat before, so they've updated that. Okay, I have to shake this cube, and then I have to feed it to him. Go on, eat, buddy. I don't know how you eat this cube, but I'm kind of intrigued. Watch out. Watch out. Please do not fall off. Stop it. Stop it. Oh. I think he's eating. Oh my goodness, what is he doing? This guy's insane. Cosmo's obsessed with the pug in the water. I mean, I would be too, to be honest. But um, yeah. Long story short, Cosmo's doing okay. The app looks sweet and Cosmo... It's looking as sweet as ever, so there you go, there's your answer. <laughs> so guys, I think that's pretty much gonna wrap it up. Thank you so much for your comments, your support, and just being generally awesome every single day. Okay, the pug hasn't really grown that much, but remember, follow me on Twitter and Instagram and stuff to keep up on how this little man is doing over the next three days, because give it 72 hours, and he's supposed to be six times his size, so I'm expecting him to get up to here 
Otherwise, I'm going to be disappointed. So yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed, please leave a big fat like. That'd be greatly appreciated. And if Sam's to be the first video you've seen by me, please do consider subscribing to join Team TDM today for daily videos. Apart from that, guys, have an amazing day. You are awesome, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye. <laughs>